What's up, what's up, my good people? It's Mr. Will right here in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. I'm just going to share a small little project with you. Hopefully, it helps someone. So, you've got these bar stools that you paid a good, pretty penny for, you know? And all of a sudden, you have a little shakiness in them, and you don't want to get rid of them. So, I'm going to share with you how you can tighten them up a little bit. Now, some people, they will go from the inside but um i'm gonna cover this up anyway so i'm gonna share with you how i tighten my bar stools up all right so i get a, a smaller drill bit and pretty much get everything centered up and drill down in there okay i'm not gonna put it all the way down in there i've already drilled the hole and then the big drill bit, this one is to drill the hole or widen the hole to put this little cork thing in, all right? And then I'm going to take this screw here and put it down in there. So it's not all the way down in there. What I'm going to have to do is go back and drill a little bit further with this but you don't want to drill too far because you want the screw to be able to go into here at a decent depth to create the uh, tightness all right so this is a simple simple video just kind of showing you how you can tighten up your chairs and not have to worry about them you know breaking on you although i can't guarantee you anything i mean if you got some three or four hundred pound people sitting on those chairs then you might you might need to start over or they might need to sit somewhere else but so drill the hole for this screw and you want to drill it enough for the screw to come down here so as i showed you earlier i'm going to have to drill my hole a little bit further with the smaller drill bit the big drill bit i don't have to mess with anymore because the purpose of this big drill bit is really only to make enough space to put this into there okay now the other thing you um want to do is when you finish if you don't have the paint to match i guess you'll have to you know paint the whole thing or or whatever or you can just put some white caulk over it and hopefully it just kind of blends in where who who knows people shouldn't pay that much attention to your furniture anyway but i know some people are really you know vanity type of people so if you don't want to do the white caulk thing you might just want to repaint the whole thing but it'll still be cheaper than going out and replacing some bar stews that are, you know, three, four hundred and twenty five dollars or even more. All right. It's Mr. W Mr. Will in Myrtle Beach. And I want to make sure that you know that I still have the Dream Giver promotion going on. So head on over to myvacationlife.com. Check it out. Click on the lady with her arms out. Fill out that one minute survey and I will get you one of these gift cards that are good at over 100,000 resorts and hotels worldwide. Actually, more than that. But anyway, just fill out the survey. And of course, just like the radio promotions, if you're an employee of the company, an affiliate of the company, blah, 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 please don't apply. All right, myvacationlife.com. Hopefully, you learned something here today. Take it easy.